What up gamers, fans here here, and welcome back to Mario Plus Rabbit Sparks of Hope. So uh, yeah, it's been a few days since I last played, so I might forget some things, especially when I just began playing this game. <laughs> but I believe, um, yeah, we've, we're have we supposed to go inside here, right? For the spark of light, I guess? Oh, we got a cutscene. Wait, who, who are we looking as? Oh, I, I think I know who this is. Is that that one new... That one new, um... I guess... That one rabbit that's trying to look cool? I think so. I just saw, like, the, the hair color. And all that stuff. Alright, here we go. Nice. New flag. I like the new... Like, the... I guess the way the, the the levels are designed now. Oh yes, we get more of the just some random rabbit stuff. Just some random rab rabbit stuff here. Unfortunately, this regal depiction of the birth of Augie and his twin Perfectus is marred by Augie's chronic dyspepsia. Very good story. Wait, these two were like born or something, or? I guess so. There. Oh my gosh, dude! I'm still not used to the rabbits talking like normally. Uh, there, I saw the spark of light. It went over that big old crevice. Cross over it with that plank, but we'd need to raise the water level there somehow. Okay. Oh, what's up, dude? Oh boy, Goombas are intimidating. I just realized so. So far, we've. Have you we only gotten just Mario enemies? No, I think we also got some rabbit enemies too. Oh no, yeah, we definitely did. <laughs> I just remember now. By age 10, Augie's brother was the patron deity of effortless victories, epic love poems, and glistening six-pack abs. <laughs> what the heck? Okay, so there is a story here to be followed. Let me go back over here just to try to understand everything again. Apparently, Augie believes he's from a family of proud demigods. For such divine creatures, murals must be like family photos. Unfortunately, this regal depiction of the birth of Augie and his twin Perfectus is marred by Augie's chronic dyspepsia. Oh, Perfectus. Okay, so yeah, I think this is pretty much the story of the guy from the outside that we saw, that we met. <laughs> okay, so what are we supposed to do with this? Um. Oh, I see. We're supposed to... Oh, what the heck? Oh, that feels weird. <laughs> I'm just used to the blocks, you know, when you when you just tap it, and it just moves automatically. Yeah, I'm just I'm just used to that. Now we got to, we got to actually push it. Maybe we can um pull it back too, you know. Yeah, it's a it, it's it's very different, man. <laughs> Such a very um different game that we're playing. Um. What the heck? Oh, we pull back. Okay. Then we... <laughs> wait. <laughs> I actually don't know. Um... <laughs> well, we can't push it there. Wait, what the heck are we supposed to do with this? I'm not sure... I am not sure how we're supposed to... Oh wait, maybe like this. It's just so tight, you know, like... Yeah, like that. Mmm. Yeah, I'm just used to the, you know, Kingdom Battle where everything just feels very, you know, like tile-based. Like there's just squares everywhere, just the way like the levels are and stuff are laid out. And even like the puzzles too. But this one is a bit more, more free. Hey, here we go. 
Dash. Nice. Let's go for another battle. <laughs> I do hope at some point we can like add more party members. Like, yeah, I mean, I, I would like to at least have three. Four would be awesome, but I think three might be, you know, I guess the normal amount. Um, here we go. Let's go. Um. Nice. Alright, what do we do here? Oh, what the heck? Got this guy. Wait, we could have gone here instead. Wait, hold on, let me go for, the, for my other guy here. Because I feel like he'll do his AoE. There we go. Then maybe with him I can do some other stuff. Like, hold on. Let me switch to you. And then do the AoE. Oh no, I can't. Hmm. I mean, can I do it like this? Yeah, like this. Nice. And then I'll do a, a counter blow just to be on the safe side. Yeah, it's a very different kind of tactical game. Like, I feel like it's something I really need to learn. <laughs> it's very, very different. Um, is there a guy behind there? Or is that all the enemy rabbits? I'm not sure. Um. Oh, we can only go for those guys. I want to be kind of far away. Yeah, like this. Nice. Then, um, yeah, why not? <laughs> oh my gosh, the breakdance. I feel like they made Rabbit Luigi, like, just younger for some reason. And then, I don't know, I feel like, um, Rabbit Mario is, it's kind of the same pretty much. There we go. Nice. Alright, next. I guess what, what does kind of suck is that now that in each battle, yeah, now that in each battle, like, we gotta go through some loading screens, it's not like instant, like in the first game. Oh, we got more pictures. The ocean is said to have been formed by the tears of Perfectus' hairdressers, who wept with joy while brushing his golden mane. So, so far it's been about Perfectus. But what about, um... Oh wait, we got more over here. Yeah, what about... The other guy? The only <laughs> what the heck? As a child was for second place in a broadwurst eating contest. <laughs> what the heck? Okay, I like how we're getting some lore now. I really want to see what happens if we do meet Perfectus. Uh, what is this? Hello? I'm not sure what that is. It's just glowing. For the dough to rise, eight hours to knead, and after licking the cinnamon glaze off, Augie tosses it aside. Is this another story, or is this... What is this? <laughs> He's talking about Augie. Oh, is this the vendor? Oh, it is. Now, we're still good. Ooh, here we go. Here's a spark. I feel like if we, if I ever do have another party size increase, I'm just gonna bring Rabbit Peach. I want to play as all the rabbits. 
You know, just go full on rabid. I'm, I'm happy that we can switch out Mario, because in the first game we could not do that. Now I can have myself a full rabbit team if I want. <laughs> oh no. Okay. Hurry! We've got to go after that spark of light! Okay. Indeed. Without the spark, we will not be able to enter the lighthouse. Gee, that is far from the only reason we should save that poor creature. <laughs> Obviously, defeating the darkness tentacle will also provide us with one of two purified darkness energy crystals we need. Dang, okay, yeah, she's just, she's very more on the objective side of things, you know, just trying to get through the goal instead of like, just worrying about the life of that creature. However, this creature's higher density of darkness energy, as compared to puddles, means our enemies will be more formidable. What the heck? <sighs> That's what I get for buying you an off-the-shelf AI empathy module to save time. <laughs> yeah, there's just no empathy with that. A triumph over the dark mist tentacle. Um, yeah, let's do it. Think we'll be fine. Hopefully. Oh, what the heck? <laughs> it's just a whole new stage. I mean, I don't know. Maybe with this, it, it does allow them to be a bit more, you know, I guess... It's a bit more liberating when they want to make these type of levels. But I do miss how like the the battlefield is like is just seamless with the with the world. Oh yes, we can get some super effects, nice. Yeah, we've known about this. Um Avoid the resistances and exploit their weaknesses. Oh the these the scoper is weak against burn. Pyrostar? Hmm. And we can use the tactic cam to see their weaknesses. Here we go. Now what the heck is this? There's a button here. Oh no. I mean, I hope this doesn't cost an action, right? I just want to press a button. Oh, what the heck? Okay. Look at this guy, what the heck? Is that a sniper? Dang. Dude, the rabbit design is, is getting a bit more wild with this one. I just realized they don't even introduce their... Like, the enemy type anymore. They don't do that. Um, I'll just dash at you. And then, um... Yeah, I'm not sure what to do next, because I want to attack too. I mean, yeah, maybe Luigi can also dash. Oh, we can do it from here, if you want. Oh, we can do this. Nice. Uh, we can't do any anything with that. But we can shoot through here, right? Yeah, we can do this. I just realized, they don't have the, um, that thing anymore at the end of the battles where if we finish within a certain amount of time... Oh no, we're good. Yep, I think we're good. Yeah, they don't have that thing anymore where we, you know, finish within a certain amount of time that we can get bonuses. Or like, you know, turns, I mean, not time. Okay. Um, hmm. I'm not sure what to do here. Would love to use um Luigi and use the um the team jump because it's it's really far. Oh, that's what that is. That's just a preview of like the I guess the movement of the other teammates. Oh. 
Because I've been seeing that yellow um, circle. So we can t team jump with this if you want. Um, there we go. Uh, let's go here. And they said that they're weak to fire, right? Or something like that. Let's try it out. We never got around to use this. All weapon based attacks deal burn damage. Right, let's try that out. So if I do this. Oh, nice. Oh yeah, that deals some extra damage. I like how we're also just making more use of the full cover. Uh, team jump. I'm gonna go and flank, flank these guys. We'll go here. Dude, I really love. I do really hope like something like a game like XCOM does something like this with the movements, where like you can just control your character. But like I think that can also conf conflict if they ever do like an Overwatch mechanic. I'm not sure how they would pull that off. But it just feels really cool that, you know, you can just walk to the cover instead. What does this do? The... Hmm. 20% of the damage intended for the hero is... Oh, okay. Oh, no. Uh, we can do this. And then we can do this. Nice. Reflect. Oh, what the heck? We get we can go more. Uh, let's go here. Um. Can I dash both at the same time? Oh, we can. <laughs> what? That's cool. Oh no. We'll have to do like a jump. There you go. <laughs> Gotta make sure we can also take cover too. Oh yes, we got full cover here. Oh, but we can't go there. I gotta go here. Okay, that's the best I can do. For now. No, yeah, it's probably best we don't do the counter. Oh, they got a sniper. Ooh. Yeah, we might need to heal soon. Can we get that burn? This will be a good time to do it. I'm not sure if we have the cooldown. Nope, one more turn. Um, I think with Luigi, I need to go here first, and then we can do the team jump, which can let me go farther. <laughs> then maybe it's best if I just go here. Then we'll do this. Yes, I can do all three. Bye -bye. Dang, nice. Uh-oh, wait, we're, we're kind of far away. <laughs> I'm not sure where to go from here. Um, we'll just have to stay put for now. Uh-oh. Ooh, dude. Rabbit Luigi has been taking hits. It kind of sucks. Okay. Hmm. Oh, yeah, this kind of sucks too. Oh man. But we can move around with him and maybe we can knock him out. Nice. Um, yeah, we'll do a dash. 
And then we can go like... Yeah, maybe stay over here. Well, just make sure we're in cover though. Yeah? Um, I don't think I knocked them out. <laughs> uh, but we can do some counter blows, right? Can we do this too? Oh no, wait, we can't. I forgot, that applies to our normal attack. We should do the counter blow instead. Okay. Uh, then yeah, I guess I'll just stick on over here. We'll do the, um, <laughs> the break dance. <laughs> do this game. And their power-ups. Let's also do a reflect. <laughs> we got, I like how both, both of us have the, you have like reflect. Or like, you know, some kind of like counter attack. Okay. Nice. And then we can also do like multi hits. Ooh, dude, freaking Rabbit Luigi. Oh my gosh, he's about to go down. Okay. Uh, press the button. So we just gotta reach there, right? Or no? I feel like it will be best if I... Hmm. Got no shots on this guy. Oh, is it because they they go prone like that? Oh, that's interesting. Uh, what if I do a team jump? Wait, we just gotta reach the area, right? Yeah, here we go, we win. <laughs> we don't need a fight. <laughs> okay, I need I need to heal. Also, we need to spend those um the prisms. I forgot about that. Uh oh. <laughs> and they got him, maybe. I think there's more of a chase. Oh my gosh, dude, freaking freaking cool. <laughs> yes. And they just ignore him. <laughs> I like Rabbit Mario, man. He's he's cool here. I never got to use him that much in the first game. this buster sword. Oh, it's this one, yeah. <laughs> this is the one I was talking about earlier. <laughs> yeah, I remember seeing this when they first revealed the game. This character. But yeah, I gotta say, I said this before at the end of the, the first game. But when I saw this character, like, I was kind of worried because <laughs> she looks like she kind of doesn't, I guess, fit in with the rabbits. Like, she looks too much of like an OC, like an <laughs> just some fan art. I think she does look cool. But like, I don't feel like she really fits in with the rabbit stuff. Because what, what, what I like about the rabbits here is that they're just cosplaying as like the Mario characters and they're just also being goofy. This one I feel like, you know, compared to the other rabbits, I feel like this one here knows what she what she's doing. <laughs> like she's aware. But yeah, I don't know, we'll see if I like her or not. I do think she's really cool with the sword. Oh yes, we get to use a third party member. Assuming we can trust the ominous stranger, having three heroes cooperating on the battlefield would give a huge advantage. Yeah, I agree. 
Um, let's go and heal up my team. <laughs> um, 95 coins, sure. I just want to keep on using rabbits. All right. Also, let me go ahead and uh, do something about the prisms. Thank Blade Master. But yeah, I feel like I would have a f fun time using her, though. I mean, I like you know two-handed swords or like the big swords, like Cloud Strife. That's what she reminds me as. Um, heroes. Um. Yeah, you know what? I, I feel like I don't want to go down this tree just because, you know, since we don't really have a healer right now, I feel like it'll be better if I just be more cautious on my placement and try to knock everyone back. Or like, you know, take, take them down in one hit. Hmm. But yeah, I'm not even sure where I want to go with this. Maybe we can go like one by one. Okay, now for Luigi. Um, I do want to get this. I feel like that'll be nice. Okay, let's go start the battle here. Now let's see if we can do this really fast. Alright, let's see what she can do. But yeah, design-wise, I feel like, you know, like I said, she looks too much of like some kind of like fan art character. And, and I don't think she really fits in with the game. So I was kind of worried when I first saw her. <laughs> she looks like too, I guess, I guess overly designed. Like, yeah, dude, I mean, look at these guys. They look so like <laughs> goofy and normal. But I'm sure I, I will like her. I'm sure I'll like her. Um. Dang, what is this range? Flying blade ignores partial cover. Uh, what is what does this one do? Storm blade. All targets within the range are dealt more damage if any super super effects. Plus any super effects if any one of them uh, moved within a line of sight. Um. What does her spark do? Oh, it's a... Okay. It's a defense thing. Um... Hmm. And yeah, I can't really reach anyone with this. Uh, I guess we'll go here. Just play defense for now. And maybe we can also just weaken them, no? No, we're, we're all too far. <laughs> we're all like too far away <laughs> to do any any good. Oh, especially him, dude. I feel like he's got to be. Oh wait, we can do the the team jump. Yeah, we should try doing that. We'll drop here. We'll go over here. Hmm, not as too far. And then yeah, we'll do a counter thing. Just to be on the safe side. Um And yeah, I can't really go back there. <laughs> oh no. I mean I can. Oh dang it. There's really no good, good place for Rabbit Luigi right now. Can't really do much. Yeah, let's try out this um this flying blade at least. Take that. Oh, it goes back. Like it's a it's a boomerang. Oh, the boss moves. The boss moves. I am kind of worried about that. Let's go to fortify. Okay. Um. Hmm. I guess I can do. Well, this one costs an action, right? Yeah, that costs an action. 
Oh no, I can't do that. Oh, you know what? We'll decide it in the next video. We are already at the 30 minutes limit. But yeah, uh, we'll see if I like the character. I think it's only the design that I'm worried about. I think she'll be fun to play as. But man, I just I just like it when, you know, we're just we're just like cosplaying as Mario characters. <laughs> um yeah, she kinda looks like an anime character, which yeah. I feel like it doesn't really fit in well with the with the I guess the Mario aesthetic. Well yeah guys, I think that'll be it for now. That's game. Wake up, today's gonna be a good day. Wake up, today's gonna be a good day. Wake up, today's gonna be a good day. Wake up, today's gonna be a good day.